Почет, товарищ! My name is Datura, welcome to Datura Place and welcome to Indica. We played the demo version for this video game couple months ago. So basically this is a story about a nun who has Satan by her side, constantly whispering to her ear, trying to make her question her faith. The demo version was absolutely outstanding. It was so weird, but also fascinating because I've never seen a game like this. Like, I've never seen a non-simulator. Um, and I'm very excited to see what they got for us in the full version. By the way, thank you so much, devs, for providing the key because I'm recording this video a couple of days before the release. And uh, let's just see how it all goes. Woof. I have a very good feeling about it, at least from what I've seen in the demo, it's gonna be great. Weird, but great. <laughs> am I playing? I am, okay. Talking about weird. Already, given the G's vibes, right? <laughs> Basket for Smaragda in the warehouse. She's waiting. Judy, take a basket with vegetables from the warehouse and bring it to Sister Smaragda in the refactory. Plus 30 points, except okay. Wait, did they just banish her uh, from the prayer session or something? Okay. I got you. What does it mean to be truly righteous? To never succumb to temptation, or to take a vow of chastity despite constant temptation? Our heroine did not know the answer to this question, and preferred never to dwell on it. If it were up to her, she would have chosen the quiet life of a nun. However, Destiny had something different in store for her. Yeah, you see, this is like actually Satan talking to her. Not a narrator, but Satan. Whoa, that's that's eerie. Okay, so we're supposed to be in alternate Russia of 20th century, as far as I understand. And this is the monastery. Yeah, I can I can confirm that looks like a Russian monastery. Can we get out? Let's get out of this town, baby. We're on fire. Or maybe we cannot. Uh, I must say that the visuals are looking so cool. Oh, look. Oh, uh, she's, she's doing the cross thingy if I press right mouse button. That's pretty dope. Wait, isn't it supposed to be from left to right? There's a cup. Wasn't it cold though? We got level up. But you see, I got the same error, localization error known one in the demo. At this point, I don't know. Maybe it's supposed to be like that. Now that was weird, okay. Wait, there's there was just one cup. Is it like for everybody? I don't think it's very hygienic to use one cup for all the settlement, but okay, you do you. I mean, this is Russia, they all reckless. I am reckless, so yeah. Yeah, let me sit for a bit. 
because I'm already kind of tired. You know, I have my uh, monastery lifestyle. It's quiet, it's chill. I go, I sit down, I pray, I lay down, I get up, I pray, I slay, and all the good stuff. Um, oh. Oh. Next to you. Do I have cameras in the monastery? Like, I'm not just a nun, but I'm also a non-terminator. I have my eyes everywhere. Can spy on my <laughs> fellow sisters. Oh, that's Russian. That's... That's old Russian. I cannot read it. It's like English. English has uh, the old English, like, you know, Shakespeare. Uh, thou, Huyao. I don't even know what it means. Same with Russian. This is hard. The Braditel is all I know. It's I'm sorry. goodness. Maybe I can help. You're the last person I need right now. Get lost. I'm sorry. Why are you so rude? Do you want me to turn the wheel? I can do that for you. Look, it works. You know, not stupid at all. Why are you looking through there? <laughs> Did you get thrown out of the evening service again? Oh, Girl, I just help you. You can be a little bit grateful, right? User manual for a Steam hydraulic machine you see i don't even need the user manual because i already fixed stuff uh, in case of sudden engine cutoff make sure to open shutter 4 and purge the steam no okay yeah it's just manual but we already did everything that we needed to do so that's good yeah they have a lot of russian stuff written down uh these are mostly like bible quotes and stuff that's a huge house by the way what's happening on this side let's take a look i love it you know oh the sound of snow as y'all probably know right now i live in los angeles and we do not have snow here, so last time I saw snow, it was, um, seven years ago. The sound is so good. I Reminds me of childhood. It was time... Well, we have pretty long winter in Russia. And it's very cold. We all probably know that. And so, whenever I went to school... You just walk, it's cold, and especially in the morning, before the snow gets dirty and all shitty because of the, all the shit from animals and stuff, it's all so white, and it's sparkling, and it almost hurts your eyes because it's so sparkly that, ugh. Such great memories. Uh, now, this is the way to use piano. Also, are you telling me that these chairs, they hold in the whole construction? There's no way. Oh, wait. I can actually go there? Hey. Hey, where are you going? Hey, stop. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It. it. I, d I, I don't really know how to... Oh. Forgive, you. For forgive me. Forgive me. I, I, I should go. Yeah, we're going. I should go. Yeah, sh chill down. Sorry. Sorry, sorry. You see, I helped some people. I messed up some stuff. It's the... How you keep balance in life, you know? Everything's supposed to be in balance. Beginning, end, life, death, light, darkness. Everything in balance. The rule of simple and perfect life. At least from my perspective. Yo, I'm getting philosophical right away. <laughs> Interesting. Can we climb somewhere? Doesn't look like it. Oh yeah, let's see what's happening on this side.
so far we're just chilling, taking a stroll, because why not? Uh, apparently I got banned from evening service or something, because... I messed up things. Uh, I guess I'm just, you know, a little bit clumsy. But everybody hates me for being clumsy. I think this is not a why, not a nice way to treat a person. Especially if you're a nun. <laughs> Let me be clumsy for Christ's sake. I wanted to say the other word, but then I remembered. What was that? It's a huge goat? How the heck it's so big? Oh, oh my god, is this shit? Oh, this is goat shit! <laughs> I remember that from Dacha Country House. Okay, we cannot go there. Well, I'm not quite sure why the goat is so damn big, but... I guess more milk? Wait, did they give you milk? I don't even remember. This is dark. Oh, we actually made it. Here's the quest mark. For the sake of the prayers of all the... Stesha, do you have something prepared for Smaragda? cold today, isn't it? <laughs> oh, potatoes. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. The sisters loved Indica. Christian love is known to be patient, merciful, and faithful. However, in a lowly human sense, they didn't love her that much. To be completely honest, they didn't love her at all. Many of them felt nothing but disgust for her. Indica, however, was not to blame. Were it not for the voice that was inculcating ideas in her, unforgivable for a Christian, she would have been a virtuous and rather mediocre nun. Indica's biggest dream was for that voice to leave her alone once and for all. Her entire life became a struggle, a painful resistance. No matter how hard she tried, no matter how much she tortured herself, the voice grew louder and more convincing every day. Wow, well, having um, voices in your head... I mean, I guess we all have them. At some point, at least. What is this door? Oh, is this my quest objective? Oh... Some book to read. Asketism. Praxioneer's Guide. Number one, a treat the top and bottom of the outer tight with strong herbal infusions. Make skin incisions across the top and bottom of the tight. Heat up feathers until they become red. Slowly insert the hot feathers under the skin while pulling it with a surgical hook. Wait, what was that? Asketism? Praxioneer's Guide. And what's that for? That was not a nice tutorial. Can we pray a little? Yes, we can. Let's go. Uh oh. I got my potatoes though. Praying with potatoes. We're already level 2. At this point, I don't even care about the levels because. For some reason, localization error. And I tried switching languages to Russian, it still gives me the error. So I have zero idea what's it all about. But anyways, you know what? This a little bit given me Resident Evil 4 vibes. Reliquary. 
preserves a fragment of the remains of Saint Balaam of Egypt, famous for his hallows, exquisite fragments, <laughs> helps with indigestion, gastrointestinal upset, and pelvic organ disorder. Level 2, baby. Okay. Yeah, literally. I, I expect anyone start saying something like Matalo Ayesta right now. Look at the potatoes though, so dirty. We gotta clean it. Clean it, clean it, clean it, clean it, clean it. La 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 la. Oh, what's upstairs? This is my question. As always, you know me. I'm a loot goblin, so I'm gonna be checking all the doors, all the rooms, all the houses. I'm sorry, Indica, that I make you walk with this probably a pretty heavy basket, but you know, it is what it is. Now, why would you do your laundry and then try to dry it? outside when it's cold AF. Look at all this stuff. It's like frozen. I cannot even go through. Damn it. Okay. Whatever. Wait a second. There's something on the other side. Let's take a look. Can I open? I... I, I can't. Okay, anyways, I think the lady, Smaragda, I think her name was Smaragda. I think she's already waiting for her potatoes to make some mashed potatoes mm, for dinner. So, let's go. But before going to Smaragda, we gotta check this other door too. Because what if there's a present? What if there's a collectible? I cannot leave it. Yep, nope, okay. That's fine. The visuals are so cool. Aren't you cold, Intika? Aren't you afraid to get sick and die? Maybe go get some sweater. I don't know. If it be better than my favorite sweater. The puddle looks so good. Jeez. Unreal Engine 5. Realistic. Everybody is so rude. Another level. Bring some water. Duty, get a full barrel of water. One hundred points. My only question is why nobody says thank you? Isn't that a little bit disrespectful? I want to go and see what's happening upstairs. She can wait. You know, if you're rude, you can wait then. I'm not gonna be your errand lady. I don't care if I'm a nun. I don't care if you're my sis. I, I'm i gonna do what I wanna do because, well, after all, I have devil by my side. If something goes wrong, you're gonna be doing chick chick. You know, like in Hercules, the cartoon. There were ladies, fates, I think they were called fates or something. Uh, they had threads of life and they could just use scissors to cut them off. <laughs> That's what the devil, since he's by my side, gonna be doing to all my enemies. We cannot go here too. Okay, let's just go and get some water. Oh, I got footprints, footsteps, uh, snow prints, whatever it's called. Wait a damn second. When I was recording my Russian playthrough, there were no snow prints and now I do have them? What? That's interesting. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, I'm a professional in this. Let's go all the way. We have 80 out of 85 points. I wonder what the points do. What? We gotta figure out what's up with the levels. Nothing. 
Nice water animation. Unreal 5 is dope. Until it crashes. <laughs> because, oh my god, guys, I don't know. If you're playing any game on Unreal 5 and you have Intel, a core processor, then we're at the same boat. In the same boat. It's gonna be crashing every damn second. But so far, so good. Okay, nice. One out of five? We're already walking for 20 minutes. Here's for another 20, because why not? <laughs> okay, let's see. Ram pam pam para ram pam para ram pam pam para ram pam pam. Standing there in an empty room, I saw you there, my blood ran cold. Take me back to the long September, don't know how I will let you go. I was young, did no by love, you were young, couldn't get enough. This is Marina, by the way. Baby, oh, oh. baby, oh. I mean, what else can I do while we're doing that, right? Just sing some songs. Try to kill some time because it feels like penitentiary. Useless labor is the basis of spiritual development. Obedience is above fasting or prayers. Indica didn't understand why she needed to retrieve the water from the well if there was a pump next door that took it from a sacred spring. She didn't understand why drinking from the spring was allowed, but cooking soup was a sin. The well was only about 15 meters away from the spring. It was not possible to have any other water there. Even a tenth of it is the same. They say on Epiphany, even a drop of holy water blesses an entire canister. If that were true, a couple of evaporated drops from the spring would bless the puddles beneath her. Um, that's actually making sense. Like, Satan is making sense. I usually do not side with Satan because, like, I don't, do not judge, but I'm not into Satanism and I do not support, um, Satanic stuff. But right now, I think he's making sense because we just literally drank some water. Uh, through the pump and I think it's much easier to get water through the pump than doing this. I mean Maybe all these ladies they just want me to get buff, you know biceps triceps lats Back muscles. Yeah, I think even when you're a nun you still need to do some physical activities Just to stay healthy because what do you do when you're a nun you just spray you just spray and lay what about some physical activities? Yes. So, go get some water from the well. Yep, yep. Plus, it's cold, and I'm not actually wearing anything. So, it's great to get some warmth from moving my body. Otherwise, you get sick, you die. And then nobody's even gonna cry, because they all hate me, apparently. <laughs> Uh, how many buckets do we have? Okay, I think we have three. This is gonna be four. Let's do it. Bam. He has biceps. He has triceps, lady. One. <sighs> oh, already. Okay, I'm sorry. I wanted to teach her some breathing technique. For the exercises, but I guess she's fast. Too fast for me. That's so nice that they added footsteps, footprints. I literally missed that. Anyways. Here we go. So this is it? No, one more. Okay. I love this quiet life. And I I like games like this. When you don't have to shoot. When you can just, you know, relax. 
focus on the atmosphere, on the environment, appreciate the architecture, because I don't think, like, I'm an American now, right? And I don't think I ever seen architecture like this. This is pure Russian monastery experience, and this is absolutely fascinating. And the way that the atmosphere is literally giving you cold. The snow, ah, oh boy. Ah, I miss snow. But you know the way I miss it, just until I see it <laughs> in real life. As soon as I see it in real life, as soon as I realize that it's cold and nasty, I'm like, okay, I'm done, thank you so much. See you in another seven years. So, <laughs> that's how, how it works for me. The sky is gray. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, this is so lame. Low energy. Thank you for the reminder, game. You haven't eaten even ten of them. With God's help, we'll make it to spring. No way. Way. Sisters won't eat after her. Mother, the sign of the cross saves from the plague. But this, God forgive me. Glory to Smaragda, don't tempt me. I'm sending Evdakia to you. Don't let this one into the refectory. I'd be so far away from this place already. I shall give thee no kiss akin to Judas, but as an outlaw shall I confess thee. Remember me, O Lord, in thy kingdom. May my communion of thy immaculate mysteries, O Lord, not be judged or condemned, but healed of body and soul. What happened? Servant of God, serve me. I shall go. Is this rave in the church? Murder on the dance floor. Oh. His blood? Oh. Many years you bore with them and warned them by your spirit, yet they would not give ear. Therefore you gave them into the hand of the people of the lands. Bible. Shovnyom. What's in it? In Russian it's gonna be Shovnyom. Shovnyom. It is forbidden to leave the convent without a blessing. Despite her requests, Indica had not been blessed to leave for a full year. When she was tasked with delivering the letter, it took her completely by surprise. Even though she did not know the contents of that letter, she could not shake the feeling that it would play an extremely important, perhaps critical, role in her life. Shovnyom. <laughs> Shovnyom. Shovnyom. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just messing with y'all. But yeah, that's exact uh, translation. What's in it? Shovnyom. Shovnyom. What's in it? Shovnyom. <laughs> What's in it? Shovnyom. Jiri. What's in it? Deliver the letter for Father Herman to the Nilov Monastery. Okay, so we are on our way. This is the premise of the game. 
mm, to deliver the ladder to Danilovsky Monastery. That's so beautiful. So isolated, so lonely, and so damn beautiful. That's given me Milan Farme, my favorite singer wives. She's French. And her song is called Désenchanté, which means disenchanted. Y'all gotta watch the music video. Please do, because this is a masterpiece. By the way, it was um, filmed in my home country, Hungary. By the way, this is not a Russian environment. At least I've never seen anything like this. Though throughout my 20 years in Russia, I don't think I've ever been anywhere besides of Moscow. And uh, maybe St. Petersburg once. Okay. For the sake of the prayers of all the saints, Lord Jesus Christ our God, have mercy on us. Tisha, I need to go to the other side. Georgie, pirate, be quiet. Pirate. The animals feel the unholiness. They're just happy to see me. Tisha, I'm sorry. The animals feel the unholiness. I brought you some apples. Orlovka, your favorite. Tisha, I must hurry to the train. fall again why would you do that you just literally don't worry Tichon I understand I don't forgive me for Christ's sake he literally made her dress wet for no reason why being so rude he said unholiness I mean I'm not Sam What's his name? The guy who's singing Unholy. Let's go. I don't need him. I can do it on my, on my own. Anyways, I guess this scene just shows us how nice Indica is as a person. I'd be so mad if somebody did that to me. It's probably super cold. I mean, it is super cold. Look at the snow and ice everywhere. Lamp. Sam, what's the name of the person? Something unholy. Mama da 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 Getting Damn, something Tihon unholy. Oh, what an imbecile. Indica loved Tihon. Imbecile was a medical diagnosis, so she was just using the word literally. In any case, Tihon couldn't hear her. Hypocrisy isn't really a virtue, is it? No, I mean, Satan, thank you so much for saying all whatever you're saying, but now I'm obsessed. I cannot think about anything else. What's the last name of that man, Sam? Mommy don't know that he's getting hot in the body shop, doing something unholy. Sam. Why would I say Sam Lake? We're definitely not playing Alan Wake, so... Oh, God. I gotta Google. I'm sorry. I won't stop thinking about it if I won't Google. Unholy Sam. Unholy Sam. It was as if the convent didn't want to let her go. Even though she knew there was no place closer to God, she yearned to leave it, at least for a short time. Not true! I think Deep inside, she hated her monastic cell. Smaragda's tasteless cabbage soup. The smell of rotting old women that even incense could not cover. 
Half of the sisters couldn't even read. Boy? To whom shall I flee for healing if I... not to thee, the compassionate oh, 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 oh. Oh, It's starting, y'all. It's starting no, so like Sam Smith. And I think his father. song is Receiving perfect for Mommy don't they know that he's getting hot. Hated to smile at Sister Martha's toothless jokes. Hated the fuming candles, the rotting potatoes, the Shut up, Satan. I'm not talking to you. Care and might raise up my soul, which is palsied by diverse sins and transgressions, and by unseemly deeds and acts. That say, Why did I come here? Glory. Glory. Praying before entering her cell, before going to sleep, before having a meal, repenting what she had thought or heard, listening to the depressing sisters. In this barren of good deeds, but I beseech thee, O Lord, pour out all the as you cleanse me, solving puzzles, many sins, and I will praise thy name. Let's go as a disciple of the Lord, O just one. Thou hast received the gospel as a martyr, thou art never turned away as the brother of God, thou hast boldness as a higher. Then I hated Smaragda's tasteless cabbage soup, even incense could not cover. Half of the sisters couldn't even read. Even if the abbess was literate, she surely didn't go out of her way to use Yeah, shut up, Satan. I found my own way. Folding icon. Bestow thy bounties upon thy people. Grant peace to thy habitation. We're back to level zero. Level one. You know what, I guess uh, this is like we're getting points each time we are either praying or finding something connected to God. So I think this is like faith points. At least that's what I think. Don't waste time collecting points, they are pointless. I just said... That each time we're praying, each time we're collecting something that's connected to faith, they giving us points. And the game right away tells me, don't waste time collecting points, they are pointless. Wow. Woo. That's deep. Anything here? Nope, I mean, maybe I should not collect anything then, because, you know, points are pointless. Oh. I'm sorry. Jesus Christ, what, what, what are you doing here? You. The Cloisters is here! Oh. What, what, None what is doing? fine. The Conventual is here! The Nun. <laughs> Listen, you're, you're lucky to b bump into me. I, I, I keep missing and I'm, I'm, I'm no g good at this. <laughs> Just what? Go, 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 go. Get out of here. What? What? Uh, who's there? And hanging on these pipes. You're lucky to bump into him. He's not a great shot. <laughs> yes. Sorry, I can help if you let me. Uh, I don't think it can be helped. His nobleness has decided to listen to the visitation one last time. So let him listen. Don't interrupt. Excuse me, what, what happened here? Oh. Have you heard the joke about a crowbar in a train toilet? It went straight to his body. So, there was this train with a bunch of convicts. They 
put a spring between two carriages while the train was moving. Tried to plan an escape, I guess. How many died? Mostly fugitives. Many of them were shot. Never had to care for the sick. Me? Of course. We often have to. Then come with us to the station. All the wounded are there. doesn't need nothing no more. Bam, this this rod and his booty hole. I I This is a way to die. Please do not even try to do that, okay? This is very unsafe. Oh he's drowning. Rest in peace, bro. Oh okay. The rod was about to get me. I'm out. So I guess Jesus well had done, another doctor. plan for me. He says the wounded are waiting at the station and then injects a corpse with morphine. Maybe out of respect for his dying wish or for the size of his epaulets. What do you think? Wait, the Satan said that our uh, doctor, instead of shooting morphine into the guy, the dead guy, he was smoking it or something? I mean, what's the problem? Why would you spend a morphine on somebody who's already dead and doesn't need it? He's okay. Wow, this is getting dark, huh? Okay. We got a piano. Wait, is this... This is upside down. Look at this, this is upside down. I'm telling you, this game is so weird. I absolutely love it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I guess it's changing the piano position. Yep, it does. Okay. Can I go this way? Nope. Wait, did I just fall under the texture, or this is the way I'm supposed to go? Okay, I guess this is the way. No. Imagine doing this, walking this plank in real life. I'd be so dead right away. Especially when it's cold, and it's even, you know, it's circly. Like, there's no way you can easily pass through it without breaking your neck. Oh, let's pray a little. Time to pray, baby. Look, my, my hand is disappearing. Ooh, <laughs> magic. Yes. Yes, give me useless points. I love useless points. Husband. Husband. I guess he was loved. Nah. No. <laughs> She's like, nah. That's very Russian. Yeah, let's pray a little. It looks like my lady has stigmata. You know, the wounds on your hand, on your palm, like Jesus had. She's speaking at me. Curious what I'm the look look look. Really so bloody, damn it. Another level up. Okay, I guess we finished praying, that's great. I guess. Wow. The 
the old theater. Paraskeva Friday. Pavel Sergeyevich in Dikaswala called Paraskeva a saint for girls, perhaps because girls used the icon for fortune telling, chanting Paraskeva, Paraskeva, show the man a love forever. May the Lord have mercy. Wow, y'all remember that. Paraskeva, Paraskeva, show the man a love forever. Oh my god, wow, that's a great idea for a song. Get it, Paraskeva? I'm telling you, I think I just confirmed my um, theory that all these points that we're getting, they are coming from... I thought somebody was follow following me. Um, the points are coming from faith interactions. That's given Resident Evil Village already. Uh oh, somebody's screaming. A toy. Whatever. Whatever, okay. I, the sound of snow, so great. I just hate it that I also hear gunshots. The missiles and the bombs on life symphony's gone wrong. And if there is a god, they'll know why it's so hard to be human. Oh, 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 oh. I really hope you know this song. This is Marina and the Diamonds. Just Marina. Call to be human. Check it out. Stop. Lost your nerve. Since when do you obey me? Worry. Fear is a natural reaction. Life-saving in most cases. Is he trying to kill her or F her? What is your goal? To, to save help her. the girl yep. or show what a hero you are? Both. Exactly. If you're trying to help, there's no chance. Calculating chances in a time like this. Oh, no. <gasps> she saw me. <laughs> Not the shithole. Listen to her. Doesn't like getting abandoned in the middle of an act. What? What? Did you see the size of that thing? Maybe you wanted to join them. <laughs> Not bad, I... <laughs> <laughs> Well, we rescued the lady. I think we did a good thing. The good deed of today. <laughs> well, ho hold on. Wait! Quiet. Stop yelling. You've saved me. And I, I, I've saved someone too. Poor girl. A little more and she could have... Oh, Lord have mercy on for us. You didn't see. She got away. Well, well I, di I didn't... I don't know how much. But if it weren't for me... God deliver us sinners from... Sorry, w what is your name? Ilya. Indica. You know, they say that every hour that a patient doesn't get medical attention, their chance of survival is halved. Crazy thing to say, to be honest. It makes no sense to generalize like that. Do we include every case, even a... No idea where to take it or where it came from. Sister! Did you arrive safely? No incident. Oh, this is the doctor. Kasyuk, is that you? Wait a second! This is GTA, boys. 
drop your weapon. J drop it. You drop your your weapon. Oh, no. <laughs> 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 throw, throw your rifle here. Don't turn your don't turn your conscience with sin. You're going nowhere, mate. All right, mate. No, no, no. Manage. I've got nothing to lose. He's right. looking like a zombie. I don't shoot, alright? Is he having British accent or Australian? And why? Do it like this. Get, get on. Get on him. I'm telling you, go. Go. He's taking me get, a hostage, get on. huh? Literally, I think he overplayed GTA 5 and now he's full of violence. Spreading this ultra violence. I'm telling you. You think I won't fight you? Huh? Shoot him. Come on in. Shoot him, my man. What's up with the music in this game? This is so fun. Shoot! Oh, just come back! Oh wait, this is the guy who's bad at shooting, right? From earlier. I'll kill you right here! Just wait! Please! Eyes on the road. Why are you aiming your revolver at me? You won't shoot me. Why is that? If you don't go faster, I will. I can't enough, just stop. Yeah, like, why is she so slow? We're going downhill. Imagine if we were actually going uphill. We'd be so effed. She's even faster than I am. Just wait! Just wait! Damn. Stand! We'll shoot! Stop it! You call who a bitch? Ilya, shoot him! Finish him! Nice. I don't think he died though. Uh, yeah, you feeling okay? Oh my god, he's riding with dead bodies. Damn, they probably stink. Shut the hell up already, I thought he was dead. But what's wrong with the bicycle? Why it's so slow? This is GoPro a camera. Let's get it. Obviously, she's gonna help him. She's very kind to everybody. Can I? Nice.
That's a very interesting bicycle. This is some steampunk vibes right now. That's definitely not Russian. Or at least not 20th century. Nah, this is something Bioshock. Hey. Hey. Are you wounded? His hand is so black like Albus Dumbledore in Half-Blood Prince. This is good. Morphine, which should ease the pain. No, 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 you don't need that. What do you mean I don't need guitar? Let's go. Well, either with me or with them, up to you. <laughs> Hop on, my man. Okay. Well, let's go. Let's go. Ooh, we got faster. Nice. Why are you rushing so much? Sorry. We're doing no more than five verse an hour, though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How do you understand it, huh? Is he talking about the word versed or how to start an engine? I grew up in a bike shop. My father sold them. In Spasov. Why in Spasov? No, in Godadishi. I've never been to Spasov. That's where I grew up. <laughs> The man's logic is flawless. Uh, are you embarrassed to be so close to a man? She's been waiting for that. Oh, he's quite a looker, huh? Thick boy. Oh, I must smell awful. No, they, they kept us in the train for three days. Oh, don't worry. <laughs> she likes it. Ew. Oh. Pardon. Come on, come on, grab her tips. Hey! Stop pretending. He's just like the men you imagine in your room when you're... Enough! All right, c calm down. Is he a bandit or a sissy? Hold oh. to your seat, for God's sake. Oh my, Satan is not playing here. He's a joker. I don't know if we're having a Satan or a joker on my shoulder because he's given us some jokes. Uh-oh. Indrika, come out. Look what we got today. Wow, can I... Relax. Don't you think you've had one too many drinks for such rides? Come on, if you finish first, one of them is yours. How does it work? W gas AD steering. What? what the hell? Is this... Is this Mario Remix? Oh, 
Haben wir dann? This will not do. Third lap. Let's go. Uh oh. He got Nitro. Damn, my father is a cheater. Dad? I'm alive. I'm fine. Oh, damn. Dear, go to the workshop, will you? Get me two wrenches, 9 and 13 millimeter, and a hammer. Yeah, do not drive while you're drunk, okay? And better not drink at all. Because that's what happens. Wait, can I collect this? Okay, whatever. And now this is who? Mirko. Whoa, is it yours? Mine? Who are you? I'm Mirko, and your bike is junk. Junk? It's the first time you've seen a bike like this. It won't even make 10 verse. 10? It has 4 little boiler, so more like 50? Yeah, sure. It's junk. Let me try. No, do you know how much it costs? Don't be scared. I'll be careful, just one lap. She never said yes. So I guess this is like a bicycle with an engine. Okay. The sun is gone. How do I? Um, can I walk? Nope. That's coming back. Wait, he asked me for wrenches. I think you're gonna be mad, huh? But we had to celebrate and rejoice for this brother of yours was dead and has begun to live. I was lost and has been found. <gasps> Born to Die reference from Lana Del Rey? Lost but now I am found. I'm telling you. Oh, this is the part from the demo that we played. Alright, that's gonna be good. So far, the game is so... different from anything that I ever played. It's so unique, I cannot even compare it to anything. Hey. Are you alright? I'm sorry, can I take a look, please? Oh, there's nothing to look at. You gotta give me an injection. Oh my god. I'm afraid this will happen. If we don't amputate it, you won't survive the afternoon. Our prison doctor, he told me the same thing. Word for word. But that was over a week ago. And he didn't do anything? Sadly, the only surgical equipment he had was a, was a rusty wash basin. Very funny. All right, all right. Don't, don't worry. It should be like that. Only like that. I'm, I'm also talking to God. To God? Great. You need to get up if you don't want to lose something else to frostbite. Is it frostbite what happened to his um, hand or... 
infection or something else? How can frostbite give you infection? What do you mean you talk to God? What? Oh, my arm. You've seen my arm, yes? Yeah. It's been a We're week. We've all seen it. Or more. I doubt it. And what does God have to do with this? Well, uh, let me explain. Ever since that night, everything, every event, it all happened as I was told it would. And I'm certain I was the only one who left that train alive. It's all going according to plan. Every fucking step is God's plan, do you understand? So taking me hostage was God's plan? I know what you're thinking. Well, let's go right. But remember the gospel. The father who gave his money to the prodigal son, not to the beloved one. The good one, but to the bandit. He who had been murdering and stealing, but came back. He came back. Do you understand? I think the Lord is happier to see. To see one repentant sinner than... Well, a hundred thousand righteous people. I don't know. I, they don't even need repentance. Do, do, do you hear me? You know, he, he laid everything out before me. Spread out like a deck of cards. The past, the present, the future. Who? God, who else? I was lying there, about to die. And a sister, just like you, bought me some water in this mug. And I was drinking and I saw... That I saw ripples dog. in the water, little round waves, and heard a whisper, so I drank, and... You heard God in a cup? In a cup, yes. But that's, that's not the point. I'll show you when we get there. Maybe we should go around. A nun and an officer? Who cares? But the telegraph poles... Oh, it's loading. Damn. The loading, they, they, abruptly, they cut so abruptly. So he was saying that he's talking to God because he saw a reflection or something the in the water cup. This? It's as if they blocked the passage on purpose. The brake is rusted shut. I have to find something to get rid of the screw. Why won't he <laughs> find oh something? Okay, let's start exploring. We can sit for a second, because why not? Yeah, we have cameras everywhere. I'm a Terminator nun, and I love being a Terminator nun, so we're good. Um, uh, Hello, anybody home? Ayesta? Shrums. Samavar. Oh, praying location. Let me pray a little. Jesus. Show me your teeth. Show me your teeth. Level up. Good. The life of God pleaser Bartholomew. Saint Bartholomew, the recluse, was so mild and pious that even wild animals were not afraid of him. He fed birds, squirrels, and snakes. Even a bear came around once in a while to snack on Bartholomew's wild strawberry jam. Once, there was an argument between him and the bear, and they could not resolve the words. Angered Bartholomew uh, struck the bear with his axe. Seeing what he has done, Bartholomew few to the ground and rolled around in his tears, begging God and the bear for forgiveness. Wow, that's... That's a legit thing. I wonder if it was just written or it actually happened. I mean, talking to bears, it's, it's a very common Russian thing. Like I did too. Couple conversations when I was a kid, oh. Maybe that's why I'm fucked so? up right now. What so? Not yet. Son patient, go and find it yourself then. I'm looting. All the icons they do not have eyes. That's creepy. The life of Saint John. One day, Venerable 
Venerable John fell into a pit. He was a good, God-fearing and meek monk, so he remained in the pit with humility. On the third day, John doubted himself. Had he, out of cowardice, mistaken the Lord's test for his will? Should he sit on the bottom of the pit in his own filth or climb out of the darkness and into the light? John started to pray to God and he immediately gave John a sight. A sprose branch leaned down into the pit. John grabbed the branch and climbed out of the pit, after realizing that in his hubris he had been tempted by demons, John cried. Terrified, he jumped back into the pit and prayed for God's forgiveness. God forgave John and awarded him with numerous spiritual gifts. Oh, I guess this is the um, place of a painter because look, there are sketches of the eyes I think he's creating. What's he doing with this doll, though? Oh, God. Um, what I wanted to say that I guess he is um, a painter of icons or something. A little prayer never killed nobody. I'm pretty sure the door is blocked anyway, so I'm not even gonna try it. Maybe there's something in that shed. Maybe. Maybe yes, maybe no. Maybe a crowbar, maybe a hoe. Let us see. And this is a wrench. Get it. Fragment of a folding icon. O oh Lord, cleanse us of sin. O oh Son of God, forgive us our wickedness. O oh Holy Spirit, come to us and heal our malad malady. Certainly, on ton of l'insomnie, la folie me guette. Je suis ce que je fuis. This is French. Mozart l'Opéra Rock, one of my favorite musicals. Okay, let's go back. I think Elusha is waiting for me, so. He's an impatient man, so. Don't want to make him wait. He might get angry and hungry, which makes him hangry. So? Found a wrench. Give it to me. I will. Just chill down. Be respectful. Be nice. Be careful, okay? Do not mess it up. What? Do you want me to help? Not a bicycle! Fuck! Lord have mercy. What's that? Just a dog. Calm down. I hate them. Hurry up. That was a bark bark. This is a doggo straight from Rezi Village. Wait, wait, Little wait, wait, doggy. Crazy. Run. Can I run and pray? Because oh my god. Oh my mama. Oh my mama. Jesus save me. Oh my mama. Oh my mama. Kudets. No, I, I would have already fucked you up with my bare hands if I wanted. Excuse you? Well, hand. Why? I mean, why the fuck did you throw away the revolver? Well, it would have been useful. I mean, a girl. I, I, would, I would never. Tell me something. If you're God's chosen one, why didn't God heal you completely right away? That's a good question. Here's your answer. Here. Here. Good yet. 
Kudiec, 20th March. Temple of John of Damascus Passive, the only rational remedy for infertility, insobriety, infidelity, and other physical complications and afflictions of the soul. So I guess people, um, pilgrims, they come to touch this uh, miraculous thingy and expect a miracle to happen to them. The Kudyets. Mm -hmm. yeah, exactly. Come on. I don't understand. So God had enough power only to stop the rotting, but to heal you completely, he needed some kind of tool. It's not, it's, it's not about the tool. A man can't be saved against his will, you see. That's true. Basically, yeah. It has nothing to do with my arm. It's about the path. The path we've been given. And whether to follow it or not, it's up to us. And what do I have to do with it? Oh, somebody's watching. So, possessed people are taken to the Kudyats? Everybody is. Do I look possessed to you? No, not you. All She's right, let's get herself. out of here. Hoist me up. Me hoist you up? Yes, you. You won't be able to pull me up from up there. <laughs> Oof. Not in my stigmatas, boy. <laughs> He said the word. Ilya? Are you alive? Ilya? Yeah. Of course it wasn't a coincidence. And now Indica realized it too. She had heard about the Kudyats and its miracles. But right now, in Spasov and Ilya. Meeting a prisoner who talks to God would not be an everyday occurrence. Also, Indica took a liking to him. Who, this one? No. One way or another, there was certainly no doubt that she had to head for Spasov and not the Danilov Monastery. The letter. She forgot. I cannot neglect my duty. What if there's something important in it? Open it. See for yourself. No. Reading someone else's letter is a greater sin than not delivering it. Greater? How much greater? Twice as much. I don't know. Interesting. So, not delivering two letters is the same as reading one. What about stealing? Pocketing a ruble, for example. Is that worse? Worse. How much worse? This is nonsense. You can't compare such things. Why not? The priest imposes a different penance for different sins. And since you know for sure which is better or worse, there has to be a way of measuring. Then let us say that stealing is ten times worse than not delivering a letter. What about murder? Let us put that at a thousand. That would mean that if a postman were to lose a sack full of letters, we'd have a murderer. Although, maybe there should be a bulk discount. <laughs> what about a rapist? A rapist is better than a murderer, right? This door is inviting me somewhere. You are not scared of the sin. You are scared of the letter. Perhaps you should not open it. Do not do it. She's gonna open. Anything to say. The abbess knows you inside out, so everything turned out just as written. 
<laughs> Defrocked? Huh? How did that happen? <laughs> Even if the Kia wasn't after Tikhon had knocked her up, but you! <laughs> First, you got pushed out of your house, and then out of the monastery! Shut the fuck up, Satan! And Pray! I am one fell among thieves and was wounded, so have I also fallen through my sins, and my soul is wounded. To whom shall I flee for healing, if not to thee, the compassion I stopped of Satan by praying. Oh, you, Christ, the ha, mercy. I'm slain! My soul is wasted with evil and is barren of good deeds, but I beseech thee, O Lord, pour out upon me a drop of... <laughs> so where now? Huh? Huh? So many options. Oh. Shh. Well, I'm afraid to please the prodigal I have sinned before thee, O merciful Father. Receive. Uh, you don't even have anything to say. The abbess knows you inside out, so everything. As I thought thou to Goodbye, goodbye, Satan. I don't want to talk I to him. I care and might raise up my soul, which is palsied by the Wait, this is a giant cow. That saved I may cry out. Connected some some to thy power. weird ass Christ. feeding machine. For as thou in thy deep wisdom hast had compassion on our souls. So what the hell is this place? I'm out. Don't grieve over lost points. They're useless anyway. This is so eerie when they say that. When they put it this way. Okay, so we're out. Where's the dog? Good question. I haven't heard it for a while. Listen, I'll help you get to Spasov. Somehow, Indica was convinced that the Kudyets was going to solve all of her problems. That soon the voice in her head would disappear. Panhagia. Panhagia, I don't know. St. Christopher hails from a wild Marma. Marmarike tribe. Its wolf headed people were extremely tall and often exhibited terrifying behavior. This, however, did not prevent him from preaching the Christian faith, accepting the baptism, and dying like a martyr. He literally has a wolf head. Wow. Oh, we got a new level. Let's go. And she would return to the monastery as someone who deserves at least forgiveness, if not everyone's love. She thought that years of suffering had been leading her up to this exact moment. I am praying while talking to Satan. I figured out what this place is. This is Denisovka, the paint factory. I'm a multitasking she, nun. She's our iconographer. They make yellow paint in that shed. Where is everyone? There was an explosion. They say everyone was evacuated in one day. Americans, I guess. Very likely. Americans. Or the English. Let's go. Okay. We got another level again. We, I think every time the game loads up, we start a new. Uh, the life of Saint Metropolitan Sinius. Once a demon possesses the hair of Saint Metropolitan Sinius, his hair began to stand up like twigs on a broom when it was least expected. That's just because of the magnification or something. You know, uh, when you wear synthetic clothing, you like touch it and then you put it close to your hair and it's all like standing up very horny. Uh, during his services, Sinius. Maitri, I, I, I don't know how to pronounce it, I'm sorry, I would jump up, scaring his parish, no matter how much he prayed, the demon would not let him go. <laughs> That's just science. One day, Sinius made two holes in his mitri and uh, tried and tied it to his head with a string so tightly that when he started the liturgy, instead of raising the mitre, his hair burrowed into his head. Burrowed. Okay. Since then, Sinius became meek and short-spoken, and then Demon had uh, to look for another host. This is how God taught the Demon a lesson. Does it mean that he got, like, I don't know, lobotomized? Every game that I'm playing lately has lobotomy. Is this a sign from above? So where do we go now? Stairs! There should be a station behind the windmill. Okay. 
I remember this place in the demo. This is that was wild. So you have to stand on this part of the iceberg and then rush, rush, rush and climb up because it's time sensitive. It took me like 15 minutes to figure it out in the demo. We'll think of something. Ilusha, you coming? I love the visuals in this game. It's looking so cool. Exactly what we need. Yeah, Lucia's coming. Good. Dumb bitch. <laughs> Why are you standing around? How long can dogs stay underwater, huh? I don't know. I'd wait for a couple of hours just to be sure. Yeah, because it's a supernatural doggo. This makes sense. Do I want to go there or do I want to go upstairs? I kind of want to go up. Oh. The stairs are broken. Okay. We'll have to go through the mill. All right, let's go. I cannot pick it up. Okay. Okay, into the unknown, into the unknown, into the unknown. <laughs> Musical pause for you while we're loading. Because why not? Well, we had this one artist in the clink. He drew his family on the wall with his own shit. They look so lifelike. What? He was like that. Didn't manage to finish the drawing. Of the daughter, though, Le left her with just one eye. He got stabbed. Because of the stench? No. He, he was drawing on the wall outside. It, it was minus 30 degrees. Shit doesn't really stink when it's cold. He got stabbed. Because, well, it's against the code. So where do we go now? The elevator. Here's the gearing. Planetary gear set by... By blocking one of the wheels, you can change the direction of the shaft rotation. I see. Riding on walls with your own shit. This is some Oscar Wilde kind of stuff. Work. Nothing works here right now. So I definitely won't judge because I appreciate Oscar Wilde. He's one of my favorite authors. It's a cotter, a safeguard. It breaks when there's an overload to protect the important parts of the engine. I see. We can make it work. It works. Damn, Ilya cannot do anything without me. I love it that our character is so smart, Intika. Go down. Oi, wait a sec, wait a sec. Can I move this thing here? Okay. Get up. Go down. Going down. Up. Going up. Down. Going down. Please don't smash me. Oh, hey, stop now. Stop now. Stop now. Oh, I guess we're good. Okay, we're good. Oh, shit. That's our exit. So you're suggesting walking that plank? Are you afraid of heights? No, no, I told you, we, we should have gone around. Ever been to the circus? Yeah, yeah. Damn. Oh, shoot. Run. The doggo. Let's go, girl. Where's the dog? Fast, fast, fast.
damn it! Come on, Indica. I love it. Ilya is always protected. I guess God really loves Ilya. And God despises um, Indica. <laughs> In your face. We killed it. I don't deserve it. In your face. It's bad. It's sinful. In your I'm face. Sin among dogs. Only humans can sin. I'm tempted by the devil. And that dog, its humans left, stopped feeding it. So it became a matter of survival. Interesting. So what's the difference between a human and a dog? The thing you're blaming the devil for is as likely to happen to a human as it is to a dog. It gets angry when its food is taken away. It's ready to tear anyone apart if its possessions are threatened. A dog gets sad if its beloved human is not around. It gets jealous, anxious, even sodomy as possible. Fruity. Remember that one time when Georgie... That's different. <laughs> I needed to survive. To find the most promising partner, give birth to offspring. And a human? You have such a simple explanation for a dog. But how come humans can never do without divine or devilish intervention? He said sodomy. Oh boy. Okay. Finally, the station. Does a, does a dog have a soul? Dogs adore their masters. Is that even possible without a soul? Does one need a soul to feel love? Is it possible to love without a body? Resurrection to, of Christ. Jesus Christ, though has risen from the dead and given life upon this world, we have witnessed thy resurrection, our Lord. What remains if you deprive a dog of a body? How can it love something it can't hear or sniff? How can it remember someone it loves if it loses its brain with its memories? In a world without bones, cold, procreation, beautiful women, rich men, bodies, Basically, passion, kindness, love. Can any of it exist without the body? For a dog. What? Uh, yes, for a dog. You see, this game is raising such deep questions. It's, if you actually think about it, it's, it's insane and like we are not even thinking about it in regular life i don't know when i was a kid like all these questions they're coming from dostoevsky right it's one of the most famous russian classical authors i read my first dostoevsky book when i was 15. maybe that's why i got fucked up but yeah he's always asking about like greater good if you can do lesser evil for greater good such important questions or maybe not because if you think too much about all this stuff you might just end up like me if this thing still Absolutely works it's up. a miracle and it's How can working I Gotta figure it out. Why figure it out? It works anyway, right? Look, there's a platform on the other side. This is already... Um... Not a demo. Not from Watch the it. demo. Oh, sorry. Wait, when's the next train? What if it's tomorrow? The station must have the schedule. What's the point? I, I don't think it's gonna stop here. So what do we do? Have you read Mark Twain? Tom Sawyer? 
Yes. So. I like it. Me too. Did they hop on a train or something? I did read on Tom Sawyer, but I do not really remember. It's been a long time ago. What are you doing? Here we go. We got it. I can't we go all the way back by any chance. It doesn't look like it, unfortunately. Choo -choo. Choo -choo. That one? That one. Let's jump! What? Jump! Oh! Do not try to do that at home. Your ideas are so strange. For a nun. Those aren't my ideas. I mean, I didn't choose the monastery life. Were you sent there against your will or something? Not against my will. I mean, when you're 15, the monastery isn't really a dream destination. But there was no other way. Sometimes there are circumstances. You have a choice with a monastery or... C circumstances? You, you were 15. And now you're like an angel of God. You know you're black all over. I, 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 I mean, you're close. Your clothes are black. Fallen as far as not, I have. Not anything else? Fallen? How? Yellow, yellow ticket or something? What? I've, I've only known one. Be married? No, never. Why am I even explaining myself to you? How she's not. I mean, I guess she's cold because she's doing this. Oh! We're getting another flashback. Get some sleep. Tomorrow is a big day. Sava Ilich is coming to make his official proposal. Look, it's such a starry night, but one star is missing. I'm waiting for you on the roof. She was right there for it. He said on the roof, she said, I'm coming, babe. Uh-oh. Okay. Okay. Oi, bullet! I thought I, I thought I could step there. But apparently I can't Oi, yo banero. Okay, let me get up, let me get up. We can make it happen, boy. Yes. Yes we can. Okay. Where do I go? Rooftop, rooftop, okay. Almost there. We got 19 out of 5 points. We're doing great. Supposed to be some other way, apparently. Oh my god. Wait. Oh my god. That's... I think they changed something. I think they added some mechanics to the game. This is so fun. Yup, Tvayo Mach. Sorry. Bloha Mucha. How do I even get there? There's. Bolla. Let me try, let me try. We can make you happen, I don't care. That reminds me of Aladdin. Um, I used to own console. I was a kid. I used to own my very first console. It was Dandy. I don't know if you heard about it, but it had a game, Aladdin, and it was something like this, and it was so much fun. An absolute blast. Okay, so how do we do that? 
I don't understand. Pam, pam, pam. Okay, go. Да я ебал, господи! I don't know how to jump there. For fuck's sake! Literally, I, 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 I literally do not understand. Come on, come on, come on, turn the radio on. Friday night, and we won't be long. Да ёб твою мать! Ай, я ебал, господи Иисусе на Христе, сын ёбаный! Ой, блядь, I don't know what to do, guys. Wait, can I just jump? Oh, ёб твою мать. She keeps sliding like a bitch. Я ебал. Я ебал. I, I don't know why they changed that, but it wasn't like that before. It's a new uh, update or something. Okay. Okay, cool. Very nice. I love it. Love these vibes. Amazing. Interactive. Fuck yeah! I got mad. My prince, you better give me something nice because this shit, it was horrible. Where's Sava? It's not even the man I expected. I don't know any Sava. Ah. I should have known. One star is missing. So corny. Where's my bike? Listen, something happened. You're not gonna believe me. Thief, scumbag. What is that melody? Okay, listen, there are two options. Either she likes music, or she got hypnotized. But I guess the message of the scene, be an artist, Win ladies' hearts. I wrote it. You're lying again. I'm not. Wrote it that evening when I met you. He won her. That's what's up. Stole her heart just like that. With just three notes. Spasov. We already in Spasov. Spasov is where the Kudets is, the miraculous thingy. Where are we going? Oh, this is the Spasov fish factory. I think nobody's there now. That's good. And the line to the city's always open. How do you know all this? Have you worked there? Oh, not a chance. My mum worked there. Floating. Be, be quiet. Oh. What's oh. it doing? Fuck! <sighs> me of my mother. She could never wash it off, no, no matter how she tried. I even love that smell. 
she was shy about it. Whenever she had to go to the store or was summoned to my school, she, she used some unbearable perfume. It would tickle my fucking nose whenever she hugged me. Where is she now? I, I don't know. But this is like coal. Does coal stink? I didn't know that. Okay. Interesting. I'm gonna go and get some presents before proceeding. Uh, the letter of divine ascent. The letter was witnessed by Saint Jacob as he lay resting on his ascetic bed. Let us embark with zeal and faith on the heavenly ascension that begins with the shame we feel before God and ends with chastity. That's what he said. I wonder if there's an achievement for not collecting and not praying a single time. No, actually you need to collect some points for the progression, so probably no. These are some fishes. Oh. Wow, we made it, but how these fishes are so large, I have zero idea. Oh my god, I missed it. Oops. What? Dignified. Don't rush, don't rush. That's the lesson. This one. This is a perfect opportunity for us. Oh god! Jeez! Oh boy! Come on, come on, Intica! Wow, that was intense. I guess now we're just doing full circle. Yep, Ilya is already there. I love it that he's not waiting for me. He's just... Ciao, Bombita. Ciao, Bella. See you, Neva. He's pretty fast for a guy who's suffering some not frostbite. Again. Wait, where are we going? Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. I got achievement. Uh, climb fish dry without falling. But I just fell. Take off, take off, take off all your clothes. Her hair is so short, but I guess she's enough. I have no idea how nice it feels to take my wimple off. My head's so itchy all the time. even allowed to sleep without it she has to sleep with it on the her head what the hell because i'm checking like anything anyone will see you if you 
take it off. All right. Well, the Dean walks around all night checking on us. Really? It's just like the screws in the clink. Mardine is more like a warden. She also manages the coin and assigns our bunks. His face a little bit looks like a kiddo. He has baby face, I guess. What is this nasty car? Did he try to commit? In the car. Stop peeking. Oh, she's also peeking. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, but the smell from your arm is unbearable. We have to go. I was about to sing some Kiss me hard before you go. When words are many, sin is not lacking. Proverbs 10:19. So the monastery wasn't your choice? It was. But when your decision has a reason, is it really a choice? W when a brook hits a rock, does it choose which way to go? Oh, fuck me. You're, you're, you're not a brook. You, you have your own free will. Free will. Choices. But whenever we make a choice, don't we base it on our previous experience? Don't we estimate all the possible benefits in our head? And if we go against the rational, don't we realize that we're being driven by our emotions, by our passions? Do you understand? As I was saying, our will helps us to control our passions. Resist temptation. Well, that's true. But when you control your emotions, there's always a reason, right? You can explain why you're doing it, build a string of logic. If the soul didn't exist, all that remains would be your logical shit. How the fuck can one live without a soul? Humans haven't learned that yet. Uh, ask him if he knows what a soul even is. Everyone says soul this, soul that, but can anyone clearly explain what it is? Yes, but even a soul has its own inclinations. But let's say your soul gravitates towards God, and mine doesn't. Is that my choice then? In theory, let, let's imagine that the choice isn't based on anything. What kind of choice is it then? Pure chance. Wait, so, so you're saying choice is an empty word? Maybe it is. I don't know. I don't even understand the point of this whole choice thing, this freedom that God has graced us with. Why would God need our so-called freedom if in the end he's only satisfied with strictly defined choices? Could have just made me in a way he would have liked me. Oh. Um, I understand her. She's making sense. <laughs> By the way, this is reminding me of Resi Seven, the uh, ship part. I wanted to say something, but I forgot, huh? All these questions that the game is raising are so wild. So. As far as I understand, she's more of a logical person, and he is acting out of his heart's desires. Oh, he said, how can you even live without a, a soul, right? Humans haven't learned that. But, well, that's why we have AI. Imagine when AI is taking over. Everybody's gonna just leave, um, according to the science. I think sweet science about to reign. Oh, guitar. He found one. He lost one, he found one. Miracle. You are playing? I'm slain. <laughs> you don't play? 
No. But I slay. I do. Once I played at bats. Bats? Where? Effing bats. He owns a tavern. You played in front of people. Got a standing ovation. Hey. Can you play something? Sure, I see him. How can I? Oh. Wait, what are all these pictures? Cup. Oh, I guess this is the competition. Uh, who caught the most fishes, right? Number one is this mustache. Oh, they all have mustache. This guy died. He died and he was on the second place. 185. Just one kilo behind from the first place. Over oh, praying. Let's go. I don't know if in America it's also a tradition, but in Russia, if somebody dies, you put a picture, a picture of them and some offering, like here, a water and piece of bread. Uh, for Lord Icon, these icons were never popular, even though they were sold for 10 rubles in store compared to 20 for 4 separate icons. After all, 4 icons on the wall are 4 icons on the wall. And we got almost got to level again from again. Every level is a reset. Interesting. Okay. Where are we going, my man? Why so quiet, mon monsieur? What the hell? Who are they? I don't know. Never seen those before. Do we want to use this? It's a puzzle time, baby. I solved the puzzle. That was fast. Where did they go? Do we have cameras here too? Look, all the cinematic views. So badass. The game design in this game is fascinating. I'm telling you. Ilya, let's go. Here's what I think. Here we go again. Chill down. I'm not telling you anything from now on. Oh, come on, I, I, I'm joking. Tell me, you were, you were wondering about freedom. Why did God make you free? Here, here's what I think. I would find myself a free girl that can love me genially. Do you understand? Yes, it's a good example. But now imagine if your Tsar has found himself a girl he loves. Can you? So? So he confesses his feelings to her and invites her to his palace. So? And now imagine that the Tsar also says, If you come, I'll drape you in gold. And if you don't, I'll hang you on a hook and burn you slowly. This also requires her to return his feelings. I see what you're going with there. But it's not God who burns people in hell. That would be those damn demons, enemies of mankind. Very well. In this case, the Tsar says, If you come, I'll cover you in gold. And if you don't, Parf and the Butcher will catch you, hang you on a hook, and burn you slowly. I love you endlessly, but can't do anything about it. Think about it. 
If even the Tsar can't actually do anything about this butcher because of some unclear circumstances, why can't he just stay silent? So you're saying nobody can love God genially? No. No, it's not like that. I'm sad that he actually disappeared and I'm sad because I cannot walk. What happened to me? Oh my, I think I got a glitch. Damn it. Um, I guess... Here we go. I just wanted to restart the game, but it fixed itself. We missed some cool dialogue, but... These are a huge cans, jars, whatever it's called, not a jar, probably can, of... I don't know how sealed is called in English, but this is Ikra. Wait a sec, let me let me look it up because I, I literally I forgot how it's called. Ikra. It's considered l luxury caviar. How could I forget that? Caviar and silt. And silt is herring. Um it's considered luxurious in Russia. We have to check one place before the line. Where? You'll see. I've hidden something there. All right. I guess Ilya disappeared, and I'm gonna be here instead of Ilya for you. So consider me your new Ilya. I'm Russian, so I can do that. Right? Can I move this? Okay, I guess I have to restart after all because for some reason Ilya disappeared. And I do think that I need to move this lever. Okay, so we're not far away. Uh, once again, this is early access. That's why I'm having bugs. Most likely they're gonna release like a uh, first day patch. So it's all gonna be great. I don't know if I finished uh, talking about caviar. But in Russia, it's considered a luxury to eat it, to have it, especially we have the to black check one. one place before the line. Where? You'll see. I've hidden something there. All right. So, especially the black one, um, it's like very expensive. I never liked it though because it's kind of uh, maybe because I do not really appreciate a seafood. I mean, I don't, not like, do not appreciate it. I'm, I'm just not a fan. I mean, okay, I can eat it, but I'm not a like, oh, luxurious. Ugh. Can I move it now? I still cannot move it. I can. Nice. You see, I'm always helping my man. And he's just... Where are we going exactly? We have to go over there. Boy, we can climb on those cans. Where do you think we're going? She can drive this. You can control this thing too. It's not that complicated. She's a savage. I love it that she's so smart. I think that might be enough for us to climb all the way up yep it is yeah look I love the puzzles in this game they are not overly complicated they like perfect amount of of uh, thinking not overthinking Maybe I'm overthinking right now because where the hell do I go? Ilya is waiting for me right there, but how am I supposed to get to him? Oh, I know. Look. Oh, I know. Look, 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 look.
just right here. But this is definitely <laughs> alternate alternate um, universe, the reality, because we do not have uh, fish factories like this in Russia. At least I'm not aware of them. Do we really need it? You'll see. Wait, how he teleported from there to here? Come on, Elia. Are we even allowed here? There's nobody here. Everyone's asleep. Is this middle of the night? Nope, it's daylight. The one on the right is ours. The ventilator? Oh, it's not daytime, it's nighttime after all. Well, I guess I, he knows his way around because his mother used to work in this factory, so makes sense. Do not try it at home because this is dangerous. Look. How is this? I mean, oh, glimmering lights. It's called a stroboscope effect. Like looking through a bike wheel. Yeah, I'll uh... <clears throat> Well, I mean, it's pretty. We climb all the way here just for this. I'll show you. He's a romantic, huh? Sit down. I gonna do a shadow theater, shadow Muppet theater, or whatever it's called. This is Puddle. She's a singer. Why Puddle? Because this is Seva. He's a guitarist. Almost there. Not almost. 
Do you know where the hospital is? Do you think they'll take someone like him? So what do we do? Pray? It's like only bone left. Oh, he said it's been like this for a couple of weeks. Oh, Jesus Christ. Can't go further. Scared to wet your pants? Nah, if I were alone. How about this? If I get to the other side without wetting my skirt, you'll teach me to play the flute. Oh boy, here we go again. Alright. And if you do wet it, will you kiss me? Not a chance. What are you thinking? Well, you're sure of your success, aren't you? If you reach the other side, I'll make another flu just for you. Deal. No, that's gonna be hard. Oh, it's gonna take me like an hour or something. Oh yeah, let's try and make it happen. Oops, 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 I don't need to press uh, space, okay. She goes automatically, apparently. Okay. Okay. So far, so good. Jeez. Okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry. From the beginning... No, we're good. This is pretty tricky. Woo! Woo Damn it. Whoa. Okay. Which way? Oh, too early. I was too early for that. I'm sorry. Nice. Now what? Wait, I'm trying to figure out. So, pam, 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 pam. Okay, I see. Too early, I'm sorry, I panicked. Let's do it. Fuck. Fuck. Don't rush. We're almost there. Blah. I rushed again. Okay. There's timing. Blah, come on. Come on, Datura. Now what we do? I see, okay. Nice. Excuse you. Oh. And if thy right hand offend thee, cut it off, and cast it from thee. So she fell in love with that guy previously, and I guess... I think she slept with him or something, and father figured that out, and then that's why he sent her to the... Monastery. Oh. 
Happy 420? Quiet. Quiet. It's all good. It's all good. Shh. shh. Lie down. Lie down. Come on. Everything's going to be all right. Otherwise, you would Lie down. Shh. 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 It's against God's plan. You went against God. Against God, not in the slightest. This is not that bad. Please be, be still. Be quiet, please. Please. Not, not that bad, huh? Will it go back? Why not? It's not like it's harder for God to work one miracle than... You didn't, work, you didn't... You didn't believe in it. From the start. You were angry that a miracle could happen to me. No. To, to a person like me. No. I'm so, so dumb and jealous. Give me an injection. I've none left. Oh, this, this time, this, this wasn't just empty talk. I know. All this philosophy. Uh, Joyce, God. God doesn't talk to me anymore since I met you. No, leave me. I'll be on, on my own. I'm Don't sorry. touch me. He took his hand like this. What is he, Ethan Winters? How did she stop the bleeding, though? Okay, bleeding. There's something moving right there, For I the guess. For the first time since meeting Ilya, Indica felt a stab of doubt. What if she'd made a mistake? What if she had done something wrong? What if the Kudyets wouldn't work? Why was every step on her road to God drawing her closer to the devil? I did everything correctly. Otherwise, he would have died from sepsis. And if he didn't? There! He's healed! A miracle! Wouldn't feel good, would it? That means he was indeed talking to God and earned his absolution. God, please. Talk to me this one time. How did I go against you? Is it in my power to intervene in your design? Is this a part of your plan? Is this how it's supposed to be? It will be all right. The arm will heal. Ilya will live. This all went so dark suddenly. So now I have to feel guilt for this as well? You can see I'm trying. But he's always behind my shoulder. Me again. You were driven by fear. The fear of ending up with a corpse. And back then, with the gypsy, what was it? Were you restless because of his tanned arms? So what I was... I wanted to say that... He was hoping for a miracle, right? And there are situations, even in real life, when people get cured from something, from something that usually is uncurable. But is it even a miracle? Could it be just the chance? Because there's always a chance that anything could happen, right? And when something extraordinary happens, people say that it's a miracle, but it's actually just how life works sometimes things happen what happened okay sometimes things happen and uh, that's why everybody knows about a miracle because there was a small chance and it actually happened and that's why it got popular i maybe i'm talking from my uh, mind and not from my soul or heart 
but it feels like it's just how the world works. You know, you can become an artist or an actor, a very popular one, and everybody's gonna know you, and they would want to become ones, but it's just by a chance. It was pure luck, maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. What do we do? Oh. Here we go. So, what I'm saying is that hoping for a miracle and not doing anything is kind of weird because... What do you even think gonna happen if you don't do anything, right? Wait, this is the wrong place to be, right? What if we go this way instead? That looks like something that could work to you. Yeah, I guess we're progressing. Here we are. gonna be enough to get up yep how did Ilya make this way or actually he used some different elevator right damn almost smashed me and where do I want to put this thingy ah huh I think we're out. Look at us being... Blah, okay, not yet. Can I be smart now? Yep. The climbing animation reminds me of Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone. It's sometimes glitching out and he's just grabbing on nothing, on thin air. We are out! Congrats! The temple of John of Damascus, the one from the poster, was towering over Indica. She was consumed by anxiety more and more. What if she was late? What if they realized who she was and wouldn't let her in? What if she was not worthy of a miracle? Maybe one needed to buy a ticket to see the miracle, and all the tickets had sold out. What if her certainty in God's plan was just another delusion, a temptation she so faint-heartedly succumbed to? Where are we going? Everything is locked here. Oh, look at this. Bonjour. Привет. Ah, uh, guten Morgen. See ya, hoj vod. I mean, okay, let the man slay. I'm not gonna distract him. He wants to slay, let him slay. Where are we? Oh shit. She can control everything. I absolutely adore Indica's mind. Look at us. Let's go. Ilusha. Give it back. Have you read it? What 
Joel. What happened to your hand? You don't like it. But the prioress cut it as punishment. It wasn't a big deal. I burned Father Sergei's felonian. Can I give him high five? Why it's moving? Oh my god, oh my god, this is nasty. Wait, he's a disappear. Okay, it's a loading. Uh, there's a way that seems straight to a man, but it ends. is the way to death. There's somebody. It is me. Okay, we're out. So, am I a demon? <laughs> don't look at me like that, ma'am. What happened to your upper lip? I don't want to be rude, but... Are you a victim of plastic surgery? Or are you just... Had the Fred Krueger fate. Stop whistling, you're gonna have no money. Cathedral of John of Damascus. That's where Kudietz is. Okay. Look, that's our cathedral from the poster. This is the giant cross. Get it, Ilya. We're almost there. But why was still going? I mean, I think he survived, right? I, I think Indica kind of saved his life, cutting off his hand. I think we're going to Kudets, just for her to try and get rid of the Satan. At least it sounds like it. Because my man doesn't need no more miracles. That's his. What? The tavern you were talking about. There it is, below. Yeah. That one. By the way, see the pawn shop opposite the tavern? Yeah. Its owner is now in Pats. Ephraim's brother. They've always hated each other. And yet depended on each other. Naum was buying stolen stuff from the vagrants, who would then go to Ephraim to spend the money on shitty wine and whores. And Ephraim's spoons would often end up in Naum's shop. We used to call them the Batshit Brothers. Why don't they like each other? Because each of them thinks that the other brother is richer. Soon you'll be able to play a concert there again. I want to see it, yes? That was not nice mentioning the concert when he doesn't have a ah oh, well hand. I don't know why it's moving though. It's like Adam's family or something. Boy, where do you think we're going? Where do you think we're going? Going, boy. Take my hand, stay Joe and oh, I think that's a wrong song to sing right now. But let's go, Lady Gaga. That's a huge bell. Wow, the artistic, the game design is fascinating. Shit, it's not finished. 
Oh, we need the bridge there. Okay, let's see what we can do. Get me down. Down! Yes, Commander. I'm going down, down, taking out of paradise. Down, down. How you doing? What's up, Monsieur? Oh, uh, thinking of a new life. Wait, what? Stop! Who you call fucking bitch? I'm a nun! Yeah, Ilya, say something! Right, say it! Show him who's the man here! What the hell? Look chill down! Yeah! Get him, Ilya! Silence! I do what I want to do, okay? Who are you? A master? A commander? Look, shut the hell up! Who are you? Go to your house while you're on a rooftop, bitch! You're not gonna call me bitch, because I'm a nun, okay? Sh come on, then go down! Why you act like a coward? Go down, Ilya! That was so not correct. Oh my god, that was so not correct. I'm so lame for that. Let me fix this. Damn it, what do I do? I'm going down. Stop saying this. Wait, can I do this? Look. Okay, I think this might work. He keeps saying that he's coming down, but he's not coming down. Why I keep doing this? This is not correct. Or is it correct? I think it might be correct. Let's do it. Silly cow? I fixed it. Ilya, let's go. Up. Freak. Disrespecting him not like this. Uh-uh. Let's get out of this town, baby. I don't like these people. We don't want to mess with them. And they don't want to mess with us. Why the hell we cannot just go on the street though? Why are we all on the rooftops? That's so weird. Wait! Can we do that? I guess nobody cares, because we already broke so many rules. For truly I say to you, if you have faith the size of a mustard seed, you will say to this mountain, move from here to there, and it will move. I think we reached our destination, wow, that's beautiful. Where's the coup yet? It's over. Been too long already. Last day the 23rd. Today, the coup will be taken further. You'll be able to find it in the lips. Yeah, it's that's still where. Here. Please, if you only knew what we've been through. People showed up from other countries. Everyone who wanted to was already venerated. It. Listen, if you don't let me see the miracle, I'm dead. Literally. Dead. And he... I can be honest with you, right? Can I confess to you? Oh, sure. I... He escaped from prison to commune with a miracle. What do you mean? If only you knew what, what he's been through. Oh, fine. Wait here. Wait here. Don't worry. 
priest will never break the seal of confession. He's had worse, trust me. He's had worse. This way. What did he tell you? There he huh? is. There he hey. is. No, no, we, we were just joking around. He has a knife. Don't come closer. No, he only has one arm. No way, he's got a knife. Just a second. He'll stab me. Step aside. Oh, oh my God. Shoot him. Shoot him. Freedom, my dear. I thought they shot Indica. Hey, it's here. What? Could yet. Could yet. But this is just a. Uh... Usually people show up about their legs. And? They grow back? It's not about that. You see, if the Lord allow... Enough. Let it go. Holding both of his hands up. Oh boy. <laughs> oh my god. What have we done? We can't see each other anymore. Why not? I'm getting married. What? This isn't my decision. What can I do? Run away with me. To wander around the gypsy tribe? No, just the two of us. We'll go to the city. And how will we earn a living? We'll get by, I'll get a job. But for starters, do you know where your father keeps their, um, keys to his register? No, what? Stealing from my father? Why stealing? He wouldn't withhold money from his own daughter, right? He only runs to his store for your sake. I have my own key to the register. My father trusts me, but I would never... I'll do everything myself. Just give me the key. Maybe we shouldn't? I guess this is not a question. So that's who steals our bikes. Shit. Oh, bro! Oh, bro! What on earth? Ow! This is what, Pac-Man? Bro, what on earth is happening? Oh, I, I got stuck! Don't shoot! 
Бля. Бля. We need to get rid of this old man. Да заебал. Oh, that was close. We got it. You will not leave. Indica. What are you doing here? Do you know him? I don't. Hey. Sure you don't know him? No. Indica? Stay away from her. He seems to know you. I don't know him. The Scytheman. There was a lot about him in the papers, but only after he was hanged. Seven kids lost their heads because of his side. What? Well, he chopped them off. Are you comparing him to me? Well, no. No, I think Makar is something of a saint. Listen, let me tell you. Makar had three kids. All of them boys. One day, he, he dropped something on his youngest. A, a wagon, or a wardrobe, or something. It was so bad that the poor boy stopped feeling his legs. Couldn't sleep at night. Lay there all day, crying from pain. The village doctor couldn't do anything, so well, Maka couldn't take it anymore. He went to the priest and said, Bless me, Father, to end the child's suffering. Well, the priest didn't bless him, of course. He sent him home to pray and think about the salvation of his soul. Macar prayed for a week, but the son wouldn't stop screaming. So, Macar snapped, took the cover off his side, said a prayer, and then did the suffering with a single sweep. He went back to the priest and said, It's done, Father. I don't have a soul anymore. And I lost my right to think about salvation back when I dropped that wardrobe on my son. Or was it a wagon? I don't remember. So, my soul is done. Better tell me where he is now, in hell or in heaven. The priest said, In heaven, of course. He didn't get to sin. In a way, you gave him a gift. Sent him straight to the kingdom of heaven without any earthly suffering. Well, this thought got stuck in Makar's head. So he went home, put his other sons in front of a kiosk, said a prayer with them, and chopped their heads off. After that, he went completely insane and started hunting down his neighbor's kids. Managed to kill four of them before he got caught. Why is he a saint? Think of it this way. Some martyr gets burned at the stake because of Christ. Does it mean he buys himself eternal life for ten minutes of suffering? Hmm? Can we call this a real sacrifice? Makar is a different story. To save someone else's soul, he sacrificed his own. Why are you telling me all this? Father Proc, the one you killed. He couldn't have asked for a better gift. He's now an innocent victim, a martyr. Maybe he'll even be canonized. And what about Makar? What about him? He got hanged. Yeah, and that father to whom she confessed, and he was like a Judas. 
selling us for nothing. And what will happen to me? You'll get hanged, I guess. Listen. What's your name? It doesn't matter. Need something? Doesn't matter indeed. Listen, we didn't kill Father Buckle. Let me go. Don't take your conscience with sin. I'll repay you. And what exactly can you repay me with? Well, what do you want? What do I want? Come closer. Come on. Turn around. What? Turn around. Sing. What? I don't know. Something. French anthem. I don't know their anthem. Well, sing something you know. Quiet forest, love, love, I. All the stars are in the sky. I am shepherd crescent. Oh, come on. Come on, silly. Don't be afraid. I'm not scared. I guess I can't do anything worse than that. So easy to step over everything you believe in. Step where? Somewhere. Onto your side. What kind of side is that? Are you going to argue again? That there are no sides? That there's neither good nor evil? Well, you can try. Convince me that I haven't done anything bad. Or can you not even do that now? Bad? What does that word mean? I've killed a priest. Don't play dumb. I'm not. But still, what exactly does that word mean? Bad. Sinful. Of the devil. And how do you know what is of the devil and what is not? There are commandments. So we're checking against a formal list of regulations. No, everything is really obvious. It's evil, dishonest, unfair. Evil? There's not a drop of evil in despondency, avarice, or bawdry. Dishonest? A dog is honest. It eats when it's hungry, bites when it's scared, copulates when there's someone to do it with. Well, you remember. I'm talking about intentional dishonesty for one's own gain. So, pretending your whole life that you don't want something you want, that you don't feel something you feel for eternal life in heaven, doesn't that fit perfectly with your definition? What else did you say? Unfair? Is it fair that one tree has a thousand leaves and another two thousand? Is it fair when two people throw the dice, one gets a six and the other gets a two? Of course, all this is rational, but we don't like this rationality. We angrily call it unfair. But if you forget your emotions, it turns out, strictly speaking, this word can't be applied to anything. What about what's happening now? What can be more revolting, disgusting, vile? I don't need any deliberations. I know it. I feel it. When you're cold, you don't need to think about it. You just feel it. You know that you're cold. Do you understand that there is no cold without warmth? You can't get rid of poverty and suffering, leaving only wealth and happiness. Leave me alone. Oh, I'd love to. 
but I will only disappear when you stop wanting me to. It's not that hard. Just remember that good and evil, warm and cold, those are just lines on a thermometer. God and the devil, those are you. One cannot exist without the other. Can I go now? Well, my dear, after this, let's say, complete exposure, no, you can't. I tell you what, fear not earthly justice for that of heaven. When the soul is separated from the body. <laughs> Stop right there, you bitch! Oh, stop! My hand! My hand! Oh. Fuck! Stop! Stop right there, you bitch! Help! Oh. Should have killed him. Oh boy. Is this Ilya? No. He speaks Russian. We are not gonna go with him. Wow, first person looks so damn good. It's like literally Rezi Village. really hope we can like she did absolutely nothing wrong oh hi where is the cadet one second oh, oh. did I undo my trousers where is the cadet well um <laughs> they didn't even give me five rubles for it. What? Give me the money. I don't have any. It's gone. You know, I've already conquered the guitar, but the, the brass, the pipes. Strong. Yes. Never heard of it. Someone just exchanged it for a trumpet. A, a man with one arm. Oh, you are extremely lucky. This is exactly what you're looking for. An amazing artifact of unspeakable wondrous power. Just 25 rubles. What do you mean, 25? You got it for five. Mm. 20 for everything. Whoa, One whoa, second, whoa, whoa. I just need to have a look. You can look, but, but don't touch. What? What did you sell me, you scumbag? Oh, damn. Hold on. It, it doesn't even fucking you work. Just puke in it or something. Good. Get your ass out of here. Get off me. What do you mean? So she's hoping for a miracle.
saying that they don't matter all these points. the sound. So this whole road, everything that she suffered, everything that she went through, it lead, led to absolutely nothing. That was a journey for her to realize that There's no Satan. That the, the, she realized that the voices that she's hearing, it's her own thoughts, and they are not evil. They are just thoughts. Like you cannot say something is evil. Like as the Satan said he, when we saw that red scene, he said, "What's even bad? What does that mean? What's what is bad?" Because I guess everybody decides for themselves what's good and what's bad. But this is just so fucking sad that she went through all this to get nothing and to... To what end? Like, she was not happy back in the monastery, right? And now she... How is she gonna go? Everybody wants her dead. They say that they, sh they killed a priest. <laughs> that... That's an insane game. We do not have any game like this that's raising such big, deep, and universal questions like faith, God. It is outstanding. This game is fucking outstanding. So I really hope if you enjoyed that video, you can really go and support developers on Steam or wherever else they sell in this game because this is this is the best thing I've seen at least for 2024 this is so important to not to have just dumb fun but actually talk about important things this is fascinating when <laughs> wow that was actually a fucking fun game the sound design the game design, they all combined everything in such a cool mix when it's smart, when it's entertaining.
this is just huge bravo from me because it's a treasure nowadays. We do not get games like this nowadays. Wow. Thank you. Thank you, Odd Meter. And I like the voice acting here too, but uh, to get the real, authentic experience, it's better to check the Russian uh, voiceover because Russian voiceover just slaps. Indica, I think her name is Anastasia. I'm sorry if I'm uh, wrong. I already forgot. I think Anastasia Dechuk. She's so damn good. This is an incredible game. Is there gonna be anything after? Well, I really hope you enjoyed this video. I really hope you enjoyed the game. I know that this game is not for everybody because these kind of questions, I'm pretty sure people nowadays, they do not even ask these questions. They do not even think about stuff like this, but I really hope that watching it or playing it actually makes you think. Do not overthink though, because you might go wild. But oh my god, and the way you're collecting throughout the whole game, you're collecting these coins and get levels, and the game tells you that this all making no sense for no reason, you're doing this for no reason. Oh my god, this is such a powerful uh, message. In Russia, when something slaps you like this, we say... <laughs> Urile. <laughs> the devs definitely urile me. <laughs> wow. All right. Whew. It's 4 p.m. for me. I still have the rest of the day, but bitch, I'm gonna be crying now all the time. Uh, anyways, let me know what you think in the comments. Support this game on Steam. And yeah. Uh, drop a like, write a comment, subscribe to the channel, join our Discord. I really hope you enjoyed this. I really hope we're gonna get more games like this. This is my genre. This is all I want to play. So good. Have a happy rest of your day. Let me know what you think about the game in the comments.